Hey everybody, I'm Nina here and welcome back to more Final Fantasy VII Remake. So we are currently in Sector 5, the Maka Reactor. Uh, I don't need to blow it up. I have a feeling, however, we're not going to be successful. It's just a guess. Sounds good, go have it. I'm not seeing the way down. Here maybe? Hmm. Well now, that could work. I'm next. Here, what? <clears throat> oh, that is a way. Oh, this should be fun. <clears throat> kind of scary. That was huh? fun. It's all in the mind. Hmm? It's all in the mind. Mind over matter. Haven't you heard? Check it out. They stick this big boy on us, we'd be screwed six ways from Sunday. Mechanized units like these were designed to take out giant monsters. Probably a new prototype. If they do decide to deploy it, then our best bet would be to run like hell. Oof. Then let's hope he sleeps through the explosion. <laughs> or we could, you know, do something about it. Take it out. <laughs> Already moved down. Almost there. Hmm. It takes me back. Oh, yeah. Echo Mist? Your silence. That's not normally what it's called. What is it normally called? Wait now, hold on. Ugh.
Hold on. Maybe I have to use focus shot. Okay. I haven't been using it because it takes all of your ATV. Guys! You well, well, what we got here? Birds are talking. I can deal with those things! Here it comes. Keep it together. I got this. About damn time! Reduces damage when equipped. We'll go ahead and put both refest on you. Okay. And down we go. This Mako is looking significantly bluer than the last one. But just kind of look at it. It's like an ocean. Almost in a way.
soldier boy. Tifa. What? Nope, nothing to worry about. Nothing to see here. It's all good. Oh, he's not gonna even... even How much time are you about you? taking? Got all the time in the world. This one comes with a remote detonator. Courtesy of Jesse. We withdraw That's to new. a safe distance. Eh? Kaboom! Safe distance? What? No such thing? <laughs> we get out the same way we got in. Let's double back. Got it. Now I'm on edge, wondering what's coming. Huh? What, what the? Where uh, are you going? Weirdly perfect timing. Wait a minute. Is someone watching us? He just told you there were cameras everywhere. Like, what did you expect? Greetings, my dear sewer rats. As architect of our populous engagement campaign, I, Heidegger, head of public security, bid you welcome. The chief warmonger. You should be flattered. Right now, you command the undivided attention of every soul in Midgar. Huh? What is this? Breaking news from Mako Reactor 5. Shinra has confirmed the reactor to be the target of the bomb threat issued by the terrorist group Avalanche. <laughs> Members of the group were observed entering the facility, and security is currently sweeping it for explosive devices. We now go. That was from yesterday. I'm here in the Sector 5 Undercity. Having confirmed the, the terrorist first target, you guys the Shinra Emergency Operations Center has issued an evacuation advisory. Residents are outraged that the tragedy of Mako Reactor 1 was only the no first attack bombings. in a campaign no of violence. President Shinra has issued a statement providing assurances that the terrorists will soon be brought to justice. And so... To a people beset by chaos and uncertainty, we will offer the finest comfort, bread and service. The big boy. I give you Sidra's latest triumph of technology. The Air Buster, your executioner. <laughs> Engineering on the line. Currently, the Air Buster is only 60% operational. The estimates were optimistic. I'm on air! <laughs> <laughs> to the imbecile in charge down there. You are here by order to seize those intruders and bring them to me. Oh, boy. Come quietly and there'll be trouble! News is already peddling their false narrative. Attention, all security forces. So we're screwed. 
No, 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 hell no! Listen, they want to turn this into a spectacle? Then I say let's give them one. Let's take down Shinra's big ass neck in front of everybody. Okay, I'm sold. Attention, all I mean, there wasn't forces. gonna be much else you could do anyway. Subdue the insurgents oh, and bring them to the command center immediately. Um, I repeat. Let's do an ether for me. Subdue the insurgents and bring them to the command an center ether right now. For you. And then let's just top us off. A Attention, bit. all security forces. Subdue the insurgents and bring them to the command center immediately. I repeat. Alright, that should be good. For now. Attention, Looks like we're going back forces. a different way. Subdue the insurgents and bring them to the command center immediately. I love how much Subdue they've the changed and bring them to the from the original. Right like, I never know what's going to happen. Looks like a few of its components are still in transit. <laughs> AI programming we'll see cores. About that. Could tamper Big bomber shells. And yeah. give ourselves an edge? There should be a console somewhere. This the console you're talking about? So there are four out of four programming cores, three out of three big bomber shells, and three out of three M units. Okay. Sure. Let's see what we can find. Think you can get it to work? Needs a key, key card. Zero. Well, let's find it then. How? Yes. Um. Oh, okay. There's you find it? Five reactor yeah. key card obtained. Good job. Now let's check out that console. Are there any others? Might as well look just to be sure. Huh. That's some sort of component? Yep. An enhancement powered by liquefied materia. Sounds bad. Pretty sure I can divert this unit for disposal. Removing M units from an airbuster will reduce the number of items it has its, at its disposal. While this does not directly affect the airbuster's tactical performance, collecting the discarded items can give your party a much needed boost in the fight. Dispose of an M unit. The hope would be to find more key cards, right? M 
scanning unit flagged for disposal. Serves y'all right. So far, so good. Right. Let's move. Diverting M unit to disposal room. Okay. So it's going in there. Ultimately, the idea is, I guess, to find extra key cards. got a live feed nothing we can do about it except smile for the folks at home We need to find key cards everywhere. How many key cards would we possibly need? Are we trying to divert the entirety? Oh. Like, why won't you open? That's why it won't open. Component outbound for B7. Sabotage. 
If we can find the key cards. Yeah, There's one. one. Just the one. Two choices. And only one single use card. It's up to you, Cloud. Ooh, hello. I'll take you. Light. Oh my gosh, come on. Mako shard. Okay. talks about big bomber shells. You acquainted? We call them BBs. One's enough to blow you to hell and back. Could divert them and give it a couple less shots to take us out. Make the call. Removing the big bombers from an air buster will reduce the number of big bomber shells it has as it, at its disposal. Big bomber shells hit your party hard. The fewer shells fired your way, the safer your party will be. That seems like a good one. Let's find out what the AI cores do, though. What does an AI programming core do? Increases processing power dedicated to motor function computation. Makes it move real quick. A real quick giant robot, huh? That doesn't sound good. Anyway, we should weigh our options carefully. Removing an Airbuster's programming core hampers its technical awareness and reduces the frequency with which it fires its finger beams, an attack that stuns targets. Oh boy. I still think the big bomber shells is probably the better one to go. And hope like hell we find some more key cards. Even one big bomber shell is too many, but I'll let you be the judge of that. Big bomber shell flagged for disposal. Is that even an option? Just imagine in their faces when they find out. So where did we send the discarded stuff? To a storeroom for defective equipment, I'm guessing. That's so. You think these defective shells and programming cores might be valuable enough to warrant a little detour? Maybe. I say we grab them. Hmm. If we get that far. I really want to be able to do it all. Do they even give that as an option in this game? Surely they've gotta. Error. Key card required for operation. Yeah. Alright. We'll keep moving and see what we can find out. Okay, listen up, y'all. Everything Shinra has told you is a goddamn lie. Marco is the lifeblood of our planet. Those greedy bastards are bleeding it dry. Y'all gotta rise up. Ferret, who are you talking to? The people. Put me on TV, I'm gonna drop some truth. Thousand Gil says they cut the sound. Huh. I mean, at least you tried, Barret. The problem is that some surprise, people don't care. <laughs> oh, surprise! Okay, hold on. Yeah, I'm here. You're And... Let's get to
keep hoping these boxes will have like a key card or something. Oh, key card! Hello. Well, let's go and take out one of those programming cores, shall we? Yep. Here we go. AI programming cores help it move faster, right? Divert it or not. Yeah, that'll do. This seems really stupid to me that they let them move through this area because they blocked off the other one. Why in the world would you give them the ability to even do something like this? It just seems monumentally stupid to me. At least in my opinion. I mean, if the damn thing wasn't even at 100% operation, why did you even tell them that's what you were gonna do? restores MP. Go ahead and do that for class. Alrighty. More the AI programming must course. Be for other components. More big bomber shells. Well, first things first, we have to find a key card. Gotta be somewhere, right? Unless that one I found on the uh, ground was supposed to be this one. Oh no, there we go. Find any cards? Only one. And this time we've got three choices. Take your pick. Probably will still pick the bomber shells, honestly. Let's see, so the AI programming cores, there's Three out of four now. Big bomber shells, there's two out of three. And M units is two out of three. That's a total of seven key cards we'd have to have. We only have one, so we'd need six more to get rid of everything. I'm not even sure if it's possible. But God, wouldn't it be great if we were able to get rid of all of it and, uh, the whole of Midgar. Feel like scrapping some BBs? Hurry up and decide what you want to get rid of. It's past time we taught Shinra a lesson. Yes. Anyway, like I was saying, wouldn't it be just the funniest if uh, we were able to get rid of everything? Big bomber shell flagged for disposal. And during the live stream to Midgar, they just saw Shinra's technology I just got no fail. Idea who he's messing with right from the get-go. Seems ridiculous. There's big bomber shells right here. And he wants to go and um, take a diversion. Let's see. Let's just make sure there's no other cards here. Six more cards seems like a lot. Considering we've only found one per room at this point. Hmm. We'll 
keep moving on. See what we come up with. I tell you what, I ain't never looked forward to an execution more in my entire life. <laughs> <laughs> you don't say. We're about to make fools out of Shinra while the whole damn city's watching. <laughs> Times like these, you gotta save them. Oh no, now if you're about sound. to ask me to dance, then don't. Come on, don't be shy. How about you, Cloud? I don't dance. I also don't celebrate early. That's a recipe for disaster. Just look at all these places where key cards could be lying. And there aren't any. Who decided this was smart? No key cards. Well, I guess security isn't that lax. Whatever. All right, we're actually gonna end it here. I really wanna try to keep these below 40 minutes or so. So we're gonna end it here, and in the next one, we're gonna pick it back up and see how much further into Maka Reactor 5 we can go. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.